welcome back so in today's tutorial we'll be looking at item diagnostic report so as you must be knowing we all work on catalog items request fulfillment and so on right and every time we come up with a new catalog item the question in our mind is whether we are following the best practices or not for the same right and this is always a gray area okay no one knows about the all the best practices which we need to follow in order to create catalog items and so on but service now is out of the box provided certain reports okay using which we can define whether that particular catalog item is falling into best practices or not and that report is called it item diagnostic report it's out of the box report and if we see the definition for this report it says for catalog item as you can see on the screen right for catalog item and data configuration you can identify possible violation from the service now recommended practices so if if your request item what you have, what you have created is deflecting from the recommended best practices then this particular report will showcase those things out okay and if you we'll read to further right so it has a matrix starting from 1 2 3 4 5 6 where well, 1 0 is the lowest if you if your request item has zero count over there okay zero uh, then it stated that you are following all the best practices and as it goes on increasing that is that means you are going towards the worst deal of your life right okay you are making it worse for yourself and for the system also so it's it's uh, in terms of correct correct violation for best practice performance okay in terms of performance as well as on the maintenance side also so there are lot of checks okay which has done as a part of this report and there are a few we call it as rules and you can see that this rules are defined over this docs only so check user criteria is defined or not okay whether duplicate variables are created dom manipulation is that ajax call select box and so on so it keep on going right so let's see how we can find this report out so this is my personal development instance and if you go to filter navigator and if you search for report request report okay report so under service catalog ad, um application we have an application called catalog administrator and the catalog administrator we have this model called request report so what this model does it stores tons of report okay which are present out of the box um you can you can use all those reports out but today we'll be focus as you can see there are active user request by approval state active request calendar and so on this all request this all reports are pretty useful for us but today we'll be focusing on where exactly it went um diagnostic item diagnostic results right and as you can see it's on the diagnostic result view so there is a table for that also a pro tip so if i click on this so it will open up a report for us so let's see so this is a report okay and as you can see if over here if you if i scroll down so there are around 7 catalog items which have the score 1 that means it's good to good to go okay and then it goes on that the score is diagnostic score 2 3 1 3 7 8 25 so 30 so 30 means it's worst and 1 means is the best catalog item you have built okay so if you click on this catalog item let's click on the 30th one so it will also give you the information about the findings what all what all need, things needs to be changed or modified okay to make it better okay it gives all the diagnostic for the same so if i click on this okay it goes it uh, routed me to diagnostic result and it has a score of 30 if you click on this 30 okay so it will give the diagnostic for the same okay so as you can see the score is 30 okay and why it's 30 because it has dom manipulation oh so it has dom manipulation which is not as per the practice check for high number of uh, high number of option in the look of variable type as a higher number of options can potentially lead to slow if you have if you have drop down and that drop down has thousands of options right then it, it may lead to performance issue and then ajax ajax call okay ajax call also make it uh, make it slower and so on right so you can use this rule out 
and you can see the document also for the same and then based on this particular diagnostic result you can um, probably make your catalog item better right so this is how you can use this item diagnostic report okay and it has routed me out to the to that particular script okay so in this way you can diagnostic your all the request item and see and try to make it better okay as per the service not best practice recovery practice it will help you to in order to have better performance as well as in terms of maintenance of the request i hope you like this video this was all for today's video uh, i really like this particular feature out so i i just want to share it with you stay happy stay safe till the next time we meet and please subscribe to my channel so that you will get notified of my upcoming videos thank you and have a nice day thank you